watching your favorite television show, using the microwave, driving to work. These are just some of the ways science impacts us on a daily basis. Yet a recent national survey commissioned by Let's Talk Science and Amgen Canada has found that 28 percent of Canadian teens believe science has no relevance to everyday life. Bonnie Schmidt is the president and founder of Let's Talk Science, a nonprofit organization dedicated to promoting science learning. Let's Talk Science and Amgen Canada recently commissioned a survey to understand Canadians' perception about science and technology in their world. We found a significant disconnect between teens in particular, their perception of how important science and technology is to society in everyday life, and their intention to pursue it. While 82% of teens agree that science is essential for Canada's future prosperity, only 37% of teenagers are interested in taking science courses at the post-secondary level. It's increasingly important to engage young people in studying science and technology at high school and at post-secondary for a variety of reasons. Increasingly, world issues are founded on science and technology, and a growing number of jobs in the 21st century will require science background. While 81% of students stated those in the science profession are described as intelligent, only 4% described them as cool. Yet the number of science-related careers available today is higher than ever before and can lead to a range of careers in the business world as well as the sports and entertainment industry. W. Brett Wilson, chairman of the Prairie Merchant Corporation and Canoe Financial LP and scientist, knows the value of a science background. I think that initiatives like what Amgen Canada and Let's Talk Science have done in terms of raising the profile and importance of, uh, of science education at the high school level, at the university and the college level, and certainly in the post-grad level, um, is invaluable because we as a society, we as people in Canada, don't fully appreciate how valuable a science education can be to the real world. To keep young people engaged in science, we're hearing from them that it's very important that they have access to realistic role models and to mentors as well as realistic hands-on experiences that are relevant to their everyday lives. Curiosity is the most recent program of Let's Talk Science designed to engage teenagers in the relevance of science and technology in their lives. It goes to them where they are using online and mobile applications and connects them to science that underpins their everyday life from entertainment, health issues, school issues and technology that is actually driving their lives. I think that the careers that are available to those who study science are limitless. Obviously you can follow a very technical specialized career as a scientist, as a doctor, a dentist, a computer specialist, doesn't matter. But if you build on that, if you take it to an upper level degree and you see that you can study whether it's entrepreneurship or marketing or finance or, uh, uh, or the, uh, there's just such a range. Or you can move into philanthropy. And my daughter is taking her engineering degree and she wants to work for Engineers Without Borders in Africa. What an incredible opportunity. Supporting educators in an effort to engage students in science in novel ways is also important, especially given that 70% of teens say their science teachers have influenced their perception of science. The Amgen Award for Science Teaching Excellence, or ASTI, recognizes four outstanding Canadian science teachers each year for their extraordinary contribution to elevating science literacy through creativity and innovation in the classroom. For more information, visit amgen.ca and follow the link to the ASTI page or curiocity.ca. Sherry Demontarco reporting.